Thank you. Kindly be seated. Good afternoon, honored attendees, esteemed guests, faculty members, and most importantly, our graduating students. Welcome to the commemorative graduation ceremony of the Tejo Nili page of 2023. My name is Terali Rebecca S. Izum, and I am honored to be your host for today's event. Let us begin. As we gather here today to celebrate the achievements of our graduating students, let us take a moment to reflect on the journey that has brought us here. Similar to the majestic journey of a seed evolving into a daring tree, our students have undergone profound growth throughout their time in the Nilid course. Tree of Hope symbolizes the hope we have as students in our college that employing the skills and knowledge they have learned at Dezo would go on to achieve great things and strive for excellence. As a tangible representation of this transformative journey, we shall now commence the ceremonial watering of the Tree of Hope. With due respect, I invite our esteemed guests, principal, and the deans to do us the honor of watering the Tree of Hope. Thank you so much. College to lead us in the prayers of blessings. Let us all look to God in prayer. Our most precious Heavenly Father, we thank you so much for giving us this very beautiful time and for blessing us this very beautiful day and for allowing us to gather here in this such manner so that we may celebrate the graduation and the achievement of our dear brothers and sisters. Lord, at this very moment, we invoke your presence and we pray that you will be with us until the end of this program and everything that we do, I pray that it will all be done according to your will. Submitting the rest of our time and our activities and our life into your mighty hand, we pray in the name of our Lord, Savior, Jesus Christ. Amen. Thank you, Mr. Aguilido, for gracing us with the prayers of blessings. Your heartfelt words have set a sacred tone for our gathering and have uplifted our spirits. Let us take a moment to acknowledge the, the collaboration between Teto College and NILID. Here to provide us with a report on NILID courses at Teto is Mr. Risado Zotto, a teaching faculty member at NILID. Our principal, deans, faculties, and all the students present here. Today I am honored to I am honored to present to you a comprehensive report of NILID department in Teto College. The MOU between Teto College and Nilid was signed on the 2nd of November 2022, where our principal, our director, and Mr. Daniel Mern bear, bear witness. And through this collaboration between the two institutes, it forged pathways of, for the students of Teto College to access cutting edge trainings, certification pro programs, and industry exposure thereby enhancing their employability and competitiveness in the global marketplace. <clears throat> in this report, we will delve into what has been achieved so far and which are underway. Nilid introduced new courses into the curriculum of Tetsu College, which served as a catalyst for skill development and technological advancement for the students. Namely, the courses were Computer Applications and Networking, Computer Applications, Accounting and Publishing, O-Level, Certificate of uh, Concepts of Computers, and Multimedia Developer. In computers, Computer Application and Networking, a total of 130 students were enrolled and one, 105 of them have successfully cleared their certification course exams. In Computer Applications, Accounting and Publishing, a total of 21 students enrolled and 13 of them successfully cleared their exams and in multimedia a total of 13 of them uh, applied for the course and nine of them have successfully cleared their exams in addition we have currently 54 students who are enrolled in the multimedia developer course 
and we have a total of 700 students for the computer applications associate course currently. And we also have a total of 27 students from the BCA department who are enrolled in the O-level course. In addition to this, we also had the opportunity to send our BCA students for trainings and internships such as IoT training, which was done in Dimapur Nilit from the 7th of December 2023 to the 16th of January 2024, where 11 students participated, and a cyber forensic internship, which was from December 4 to January 25th, 2024, where two students participated from the BCA department. And we have uh, we had the opportunity to send our students to Nilit Chandigarh for IoT training, which was held from December 17, 2023 to January 18, 2024, where eight students went for their internships. In conclusion, though at its infant stage, Nilit Tatso have strived for excellence in various capacities as listed so far, our future in endeavor holds to the same principles and that we will continue to be a catalyst for skill development and technological advancement for the students so that they will be uh, ready for their, their bright future ahead. Thank you. Thank you, sir, for graciously providing us with such an insightful report. I now invite with great pleasure our esteemed principal, Dr. Hewasa L. Kim, to address the crowd. You may kindly take your time. Good afternoon, everyone. Our respected chair, chairperson, our special guest, Mr. Daniel Marin, our deans, teaching faculty, and our graduating students. It is a pleasure for me to be standing here and addressing you all on this uh, special day as we acknowledge your achievement, the completion of your needlet course here at Detso College. Today, as announced earlier by Mr. Visato, 137 students are graduating completing three courses that were offered by our NEELIT instructors uh, this year. Uh, we are proud of the time and the commitment, the energy that you've taken to complete this course diligently throughout. And I hope that um, you'll be graduating not just with a certificate, but with practical skills, with the knowledge of how to leverage on using technology, on how to use computers to aid you in, in your life. Whatever profession it is that you choose to move into, or whether it's higher education, or whatever job commitments that you may have, I hope that these skills will uh, empower you to be able to do an excellent job so that you may continue to keep on striving for excellence, which is what the motto of our college is. I thank our special guest, Mr. Daniel Merritt, the Joint Director and Scientist at Needlet Dimapur, for taking the time out to grace this occasion to address all of you um, on behalf and representing Needlet. We are extremely happy that we could have signed an MOU with Needed in the year 2022, and because of which uh, it has enabled the students of Ditzel College to take up free computer classes on very important courses that will uh, be beneficial to all of you for life. During my time when I was a student, um, computers and technology was just emerging. And during my, our parents' time, which would be your grandparents' time, computers did not exist. They used what we call typewriters. I don't know if you all know what typewriters are or whether some of you have seen it, but typewriters to type on paper to get the message across, to type out letters, to type out applications. 
The world has changed so much, and now we have computers and technology to aid your learning, to make communication quicker, to help you in your jobs, to collect data, to deal with large numbers, to do research, to, to do your jobs much more organized and efficiently and in a more structured manner. Uh, these are very challenging times, but also good times if you know how to use all the technology, all the knowledge that you have at your disposal and to your advantage. So I encourage each one of you to use this practical knowledge that you gain today in your lives to aid you to become better versions of yourself. Don't just stop here with getting this needed certificate, by, but I encourage you and advise you all to learn new courses, to go up online and to search for additional courses that can enhance your skills or to take up more needed courses uh, that you can learn. Those of you who have not taken multimedia developer can take up these courses or even new additional courses. Don't stop at this one certificate alone and make sure that you're using these practical skills and putting it into practice so that you don't forget, okay? So once again, um, I just congratulate all of you and I wish you all the best. I hope that you use this knowledge uh, to the best of your ability and that this certificate may be a validation and proof of your commitment and the time that you've spent, but also a reminder to you to continue to take up such additional courses, not just academic courses, and to not just graduate at the Zoo College with your undergraduate degree, but to take up the add-on courses, add-on skills, anything that can help you, because the world is so competitive. Everyone has a degree these days. We believe that our Tetsuo students are graduates who are employable, who will be able to use their knowledge to get a job, to get a seat in higher education, in universities across the world, and be able to travel places and contribute in the workspace or in any special field or domain that you like to. So please remember that and keep working hard, and as our motto states, once again, I conclude with, let's keep striving for excellence. Thank you. Before we move forward, I invite our principal once again to hand out the momentos to our dignitaries. We have uh, doc Dr. Daniel Murren, Joint Director and Scientist E from Nili Timapu. <laughs> Second, we have Sir Apong from Nili Timapu. Now, I would like to invite Mr. Yim Ti Yong Longcomer, a student from the Department of History, to deliver a speech on behalf of the graduating students. A very good afternoon. Our distinguished special guest, Mr. Daniel Mer, and Sir Abel, staff of Nilit, our esteemed principal, deans, faculties and my dears standing here on behalf of the batch of 2022 Nilit. First and foremost, I would like to extend my grat our gratitude on behalf of the class of 2023 uh, to Nilit and Tetsu College for giving us the opportunity to take up this course. Today marks a significant 
milestone in our lives as we gather to celebrate the completion of our course in computer applications and networking and multimedia developer, computer applications, accounting, and publishing. As we stand on the threshold of the future, it is a moment to reflect on the journey we've undertaken and the possibilities that lie ahead. We are at a crossroads where technology, computer science, and mankind are very close to forming a kind of symbiotic relationship, especially with the breakthrough of Elon Musk's Neuralink. And while that is on a completely different level as compared to what we've learned, I, I believe that the course that we've all taken is one of the first steps in order to adapt to this changing world of technology. Throughout this course, we've learned to work with Excel sheets, create logos, PPTs, magazine templates, photo and vi video editing, to also configuring and setting up the computer hardware, configuring networks, uh, where even getting Ethernet cables to work properly was a pretty tricky task, and many more. So we've acquired a versatile set that equips us for the challenges of the digital age. But beyond the technical knowledge gained, this journey has been more than just mastering tools and techniques. It's been about cultivating a mindset of innovation, problem solving, self-dependence and adaptability. In an era where change is constant, the ability to learn, unlearn, and relearn is paramount. So as we step up into the professional world, we carry with us not only the certificates we receive today, but also the friendships that we forged, the challenges overcome, and the lessons learned. In closing, I want to extend my heartfelt congratulations to each and every one of my fellow graduates and also a big thank you to our teachers for their unwavering guidance and patience. Today we celebrate not only our achievements, but also the boundless potential that lies within us. Together, let us go forth and shape the future, leaving an indelible mark on the world. Thank you. for sharing your thoughts with us. Now, it is time for the most anticipated moment of the ceremony, the awarding of certificates. I would like to invite the director of NILID, Dr. Daniel Murren, joint director and signed this E from NILID Dimapur, to come forward and present the certificates to our top students as well as our page representatives. Our top performers of Tetsu Nilid page are Yim Ti Yong Longkamer from Computer Applications and Networking, Lika H. Yepto from Multimedia Developer, and M. T. Noshad Alam Ansari from Computer Applications, Accounting, and Publishing. Toppers, kindly come forward and collect your well deserved certificates. First, we have Yim Ti Yong Longkamer from Computer Applications and Networking. Next, we have Lika H. Yaptou from Multimedia Developer followed by M.T. Noshad Alam Ansari from Computer Applications, Accounting and Publishing. representatives to collect the certificates. I request the representatives to come forward as I call their names. 
Onan Kokla Jemir from Computer Applications and Networking. Anisi E. Naki from Multimedia Developer. And Christy Patton from Computer Applications, Accounting and Publishing. Christy Patton from Computer Applications, Accounting and Publishing. If she is not present, I request one of her friends to come and collect the certificate. Thank you, sir. That will be. Congratulations to all the graduates on this momentous achievement. Your unwavering commitment and perseverance have yielded a remarkable success, and we are truly proud of you all. Moving forward, I am truly honored to extend a warm welcome to our distinguished special guest, Mr. Daniel Marin, Joint Director and Scientist E from Nili Timopur. Koima Extension Center, who will grace us with his profound remarks. Sir, you may kindly take your time. Good afternoon to all of you, respected uh, host of today's program, respected uh, administrator and director of Tetsu College, uh, Shuri Lori. Uh, Principal of this college, Dr. Hewasa L. King, Dean, uh, teaching faculties, staffs, and staffs of Tetsuo College, uh, and my dear students. Uh, first of all, I would like to thank the college as well as the organizers of this wonderful program for inviting me to be here today on this special uh, graduate graduation ceremony of Tetsuo Nailit batch 2023. So it is indeed a very happy moment to see all the students who have graduated and completed this NILIT certified courses. Uh, in fact, uh, before I go deeper, I would just like to bring an example. Like uh, last year, we had a job fair at our center at NILIT Dimapur. Now, uh, in that job fair, we came to know that there are many people, there are many organizations, there are many companies that require, okay, skills. They don't require, you know, your educational qualifications, but they are in need of various skills. And from there, we also came to learn that 90% of the skills is in the field of uh, multimedia. Okay, multimedia, like... Uh, you know, graphic designing, video editing, and uh, animations, and also similar to that, similar to that, uh, ninety percent, there was also a demand for tele also, okay, tele in financial accounting, and especially with GST and other related taxes. So this was the thing that we came to know, and we are very very uh, grateful to the administrator of this college, who you know. I think I can say that he has a very visionary, he's a visionary leader who feels that, you know, the students of this college should learn all these skills while you do your regular course. Isn't it wonderful? Right. So I feel that you guys are very lucky that you are able to complete this course while you are doing your regular education. Now, our courses, NILIT courses, are designed in such a way that, okay, um, we are targeting you to become employable, like just like our ma'am, you know, the principal has said today that it's all about the employability, how employable you are once you pass out from this college. We want you to become employable. Now, so many graduates are there, so many people are there, okay, and still then jobs are also available. It's just that the people are not writing the right person with the right skills. Okay, and given that you have an opportunity to learn all the different skills here in the college, okay, it's a very great opportunity for you all. Now, uh, for example, we have this uh, computer application and networking courses. 
and I'm sure that you have experienced that right from the very basic okay right from the very basic to how to use graphic softwares how to use video editing softwares and also we just heard from the one of the student that they have learned how to do cabling also so that is a very actually that's a very basic skill that is required for for each and every person out here today all right now we have also another course called multimedia developer now in the multimedia developer i'm sure that we focus more on the develop uh, i mean more on the designing of graphics designing of uh, videos and designing of animations so these are the skills that is in demand in the market now okay now if you look at any organization or even if you look at the government sector each and every department they require one graphic designer they require one uh, video video editing person why because it's all about social media also right whenever we today also we are having a program right today also we are having a program so someone is there to take the pictures someone is there to go and you know edit these pictures do something with the pictures do something with the videos and then upload it in the social media right so not only our college but it is required in each and every colleges as well as even in the government sector also so this is in high demand now and with regard to computer application accounting and publishing see today even a small organization even a small entrepreneur they have to pay taxes gst is there okay we have tax deducted at source tds is there so these are the things which a normal a layman person may not know but all of these things is being done through the softwares so we are now providing daily softwares so that the commerce students once you pass out from your college you will be you know employable to this kind of organization to this kind of uh, requirements all right now another great thing about nylit courses is that see the way you have conducted your examination you're aware of it right so for the theory examinations objective type questions were asked right so the main target of this is that see when you start studying these objective type questions there's a high probability that when you go and appear some competitive exams questions whatever you have studied may come in these competitive exams and from last uh, experience we came to know that many of the questions were there in the competitive exams like npsc and ssb and all so it's, it becomes an advantage we have an upper edge as compared to the others right so even for you also whatever you have studied is not going to go in vain all right now uh yeah i would also like to say that many of our students from nilit dimapur they have you know they have been observed in different companies in dimapur okay and they have even gone gone on for their own ventures also now i would like to take two names like one guy is called uh mr mitsisile okay he has undertaken a uh, multimedia developer and another guy inohoto okay achumi so what we did was we have observed them in our office okay we have observed them in our office we didn't let them go out because the way they have learned the skill is that in fact we are the you know training person but in fact we require their service so that is the demand okay now if i let them go then they will be observed by any other companies in in and around nagaland all right so it, there's so much demand that okay people peop, see if half back knowledge it will not help you so whatever you have learned now may not be 100% perfect okay so you have to keep on learning just that whatever certificate we have issued today is not going to get you a job but your skill whatever you know will help you only okay so till today whatever you have learned we i request you i urge you to improve on that okay and you know try to learn more and more all right try to become perfect on whatever you have learned from here okay now uh, i just want to ask one question diverting from this how many of you people are using gen ai tools for your uh, educational requirements are you using generative ai tools students or is it banned in the college are you using or not Raisin, no one is going to say anything. Okay, so 
Mm, like since I already came here and since this is my first time here, I would like to take this opportunity, okay, to say that the future jobs, okay, the future jobs will require people who are knowledgeable about this Gen AI tools, okay. In the future, there will be lots of jobs, okay, lots, of, lots and lots of jobs. But if you don't have this AI knowledge, then you may not be employable, okay. Now you have learned Microsoft Office, right? Microsoft Word, Excel, PowerPoint, and all, right? Now AI is being integrated into all those things, right? I think you have you know that, right? So you need to go a little bit higher step and try to learn this. Even in case of let's say Photoshop, I think you're since you're all aware of that, in Photoshop also generative AI is there. Have you ever tried that? Okay, so if you are lagging behind in this Gen AI, okay, then you'll be not employable. So I urge you to start using this Gen AI tools like ChatGPT, okay. So I just say the name ChatGPT since I think most of you would be familiar. But uh, the generative AI is the you know general name for this. So it can be in the in Photoshop, it can be in Word, Word, it can be in Excel, or it can be in any other softwares. Okay, so you need to start exploring this in order for you to become you know future employable. All right. So, uh, like I said, every government departments, every private organization, or even if you want to become an entrepreneur, without this Gen AI tools on how to use it effectively, you may be. You may be lagging. All right. Now, with this, I would like to encourage you to embrace technology. Whatever you have learned from these courses, you have to keep on upgrading your skills. Okay. There are a lot of tools available online, and someone has already suggested that if you have completed uh, computer application networking, why don't you go for uh, multimedia developer and so on. So, it, um, learning is never an ending process. So, I would like to encourage you once again that you keep on you know uh, looking for uh, skill oriented courses which will really help you once you complete your formal education okay thank you thank you sir for your insightful words you have beautifully complimented the significance of this momentous occasion I now invite Sir Apong, teaching faculty Nili, to deliver the words of gratitude. Nili, uh, Dimitri, a very good afternoon. On behalf of the faculty, I extend a heartfelt appreciation to our graduating students. Your hard work and dedication has led to led you to this in, uh, significant milestone, and we are immensely proud of each and every one of you. Our great gratitude also extends to the director and principal of Tetsu College for supporting our students in pursuing the lead courses. Your belief in them has been pivotal for their success and, and we are very thankful, thankful for your unwavering support. A special thanks to our esteemed guest, the Nilit of uh, director of Nilit Koyama for gracing us with your presence and sharing your invaluable wisdom with, with our graduates. We acknowledge the dedication of our faculty and staff whose mentorship has prepared our students for their future. Your commitment to the excellence is commendable and we appreciate your effort. Lastly, Gratitude to the event organizers, volunteers, and all the behind the scenes contributors for ensuring the success of this ceremony. Let's celebrate the achievement of our graduates and eagerly anticipate their bright future. Congre congratulations once again to the NILIT batch of 2023. Thank you. 2023. Our time for the course may have been short, but our consistent efforts in calling our instructor from all corners of the classroom have truly yielded significant results. Thank you all for joining us today. Let us continue to celebrate the achievements of our graduates and wish them success in all their future endeavors. Have a wonderful afternoon. You may disperse. <laughs>